this video shows how you can name the series in Google Sheet. So here I have got one chart with temperature, humidity. These are the series. Uh, for each city, I am displaying temperature, humidity. Now uh, let us say you want to edit that or name that uh, series. Then what you have to do is that select that chart and then click on Edit Chart. And after that, uh, you will be uh, taken to this particular page. In the data section, you will see this series. So there are two series right now: temperature, humidity. And uh, if you want to change this uh, particular series, you can change directly over here in the data itself. Like from temperature, if you want to say right temperature in the actual name. And here you can see that this uh, particular uh, series has changed from temp to temperature. And I'm gonna show you how you can uh, insert more uh, some more series in that. So for that, click on edit uh, this particular uh, chart, and then all you have to do is just add, uh, let us say you want to add another series, then just uh, for the moisture suppose. Here you can give uh, any points if you want. And uh, then in the existing chart, if you want to add that particular series, then just click on edit chart. And then uh, here there is one button add series, just click on that. And then here you have to give the range. So this is the range that I want to give. Click on OK. So you can see that uh, another series has been added that is moisture and the bar is also showing that values. Or if you want to drill it, you can also remove that or you can add labels for that series as well. You can also click on edit to uh, give the different range or you can add the labels as well. Uh, for that uh, you have to give the range. And uh, there is different setting uh, like if you want to combine the ranges horizontally or vertically. You can also switch rows and columns if you want. You can also aggregate the columns as well. So that's how you can uh, like uh, you know deal with this series change or uh, settings in Google Sheet. Thanks for watching this video.